Fantasy fanfiction. The end is coming, fortunately I have a doomsday simulator. Chapter 31. Linen turned off the engine, stopped the car, and looked at Chen Wei and a few who were surrounding him with a dull expression. Perhaps it was because he had made up his mind to clean up them. Now Linen has no emotions, and just feels a little bored. Looking left and right, there was only a black car parked next to it, which was quite conspicuous, and there was no one else. Packed up early to sleep. Go in and talk. Linen didn't talk nonsense. He took the key to open the warehouse door. Chen Wei and the four younger brothers looked at each other and followed behind. The last one to enter, he closed the door from the inside with a grin and locked the door with the bolt inside. Linen glanced at it, retracted his gaze, took a few steps in, looked around in the warehouse, and saw a thick lump of industrial tape that the workers had left behind when they cleaned up the house. Brother Lin, brother, I've been waiting for you, and I've given enough face. You can't show any more brothers. Chen Hui's voice was low and cold. Linen absentmindedly hummed, and had observed before coming here that there was no one around the warehouse, except for Chen Wei and his four younger brothers, there was no one else. He pointed casually, sit first. Chen Wei looked at each other and sat on Lin An's sofa. Linen opened the refrigerator, picked up a bottle of mineral water, took a few sips, and put the mineral water bottle on the coffee table. Did you tell anyone else that you were here before you came? Linen asked suddenly. Chen Hui's heart skipped a beat, it's broken, he really forgot to make a backup before he came here, if this kid has bad intentions, in this remote suburb, even if a few of himself are killed, I'm afraid it will take ten and a half days it took a month to find out. They themselves are a bunch of gangsters, and they usually have enemies, and they will tell others where they are going. For family members, it is normal for people like them to disappear for a while, and they may not know where to go to play. Several younger brothers were also called directly by him temporarily, saying that they were going to do a big business, and it was impossible to tell the family where they went. Chen Hui's expression remained unchanged, and he said, what? Before I left, I said a few words to some of my friends, what does it have to do with it? This is a lie. As soon as Lin and turned his head, the mind reader saw the uneasiness in his heart for real, and lied to him, which was really bad luck. I didn't say it, that's fine. As soon as he said this, Chen Hui's face changed greatly, and then he noticed that Lin and had walked two steps in front of him. His hand suddenly touched the lower back, but before he could reach the handle of the gun, the next moment, Lin An's punch had already landed on his chin. Dizzy, as if the world was turning upside down, breathing seemed to be still for an unknown time. Chen Wei suddenly lost consciousness and was knocked unconscious to the ground. When the rest of the younger brothers saw this, they immediately roared. But Lin and just followed Chen Hui's movements and took out a black pistol that looked a little dirty from his lower back. I don't know which ruthless man hand polished the earthen pistol. Don't, don't shoot. A timid one immediately fell to his knees and raised his hand. There was another, but the adrenaline was soaring, and the moment Lin and took out the pistol, he roared at him irrationally. And then, no then. In the face of such a street gangster-like fighting, Linen just kicked out, the fierce gangster went wherever he went, and was kicked back on the sofa again, clutching his stomach and couldn't stand up again. These days, Linen has also seen the corresponding shooting teaching on the internet, and he also has a little understanding of firearms. Although not much, it is enough for him to fiddle with the broken gun in his hand. The remaining two scoundrels dared not move. The person who knows the current affairs is Junji. I'm not interested in killing people. Let's cooperate, okay. Linen didn't say anything arrogant and domineering. When dealing with them before, he only acted a bit domineering and manic because of cooperation. Now that he no longer has any thoughts of being vain and arrogant, it's easy to get it done. The remaining three thugs squatted on the ground tremblingly. You say, Brother Lin, you have the final say. Chen Wei was still dizzy at the moment, and he couldn't tell the difference between the North and the South for a while. He barely opened his eyes several times, but all he could see was that the world was spinning. Linen grabbed his collar with one hand, picked him up and checked it, then took out a knife, a mobile phone, a wallet, and a car key. Afterwards, he threw Chen Wei to the two thugs, and after looking at it, he saw an acquaintance, the kind person who had been staring at him all day in the warehouse and lent him his motorcycle. Just you, motorcycle boy, do you see the tape over there? 
The hands and feet are tied up and tied tightly. Linen moved his chin and pointed to the industrial tape beside him. You two, tie that up first. Then, he instructed the remaining two gangsters to tie up the gangster who was kicked by him and couldn't stand up. Then, Linen sat on the back of the sofa to supervise the work. A few thugs swiftly tied the people with industrial tape, and Linen signaled them to tie themselves up too. When a group of people turned into dumplings, Linen did it himself. Bundled a few times. As long as the industrial tape is tied a few more times, it is basically no different from the rope. With their ability, they can't break free without help. Chen Wei only regained some consciousness from the dizziness at this time, do you know what you are doing? Lin En, don't let me go, I tell you, if I don't go back tonight, you will be finished tomorrow. Lin En didn't bother to pay attention to his pretended calm and fierce, looked at him with a calm expression, don't talk nonsense, I know you didn't get along with others this time. As for me, I shouldn't be a good person. Lin An's self-introduction made the other people shiver. However, it's not a pervert that destroys humanity. Lin An arranged a path for them in a calm narrative tone. As long as you keep quiet and don't cause me trouble, I'll let you go in six days. Lin An's voice fell, and the trembling thugs who were originally scared immediately nodded, babbling about being absolutely honest. Chen Wei lowered his head, and his eyes were a little dazed. Brother, I admit it, you can make it as much as you want. We also come out to mix, know the rules, don't cause you trouble, save a life for the brother, brother confessed, brother, brother Lin. Lin and didn't answer, but took out their mobile phones, unlocked them one by one, cancelled the original mobile phone password, and set it up as his own. Later, they found their family members from the address book. Now report the safety of your family and tell them that you will go back in six days, no problem. After Lin and finished speaking, Chen Wei breathed a sigh of relief. He hurriedly smiled and said, Brother Lin, no problem, we will cooperate with whatever you want. If you really plan to kill them all, there is absolutely no need to say that you will go back in six days. Isn't that asking for trouble? Lin and sent a message according to their usual tone, and after waiting for a while to receive a few replies, he threw the phone aside. Grab the tape and give them one by one to seal their mouths too. Keep quiet, you can go back in six days. After Lin and finished speaking, he dragged them into the bathroom one by one. The warehouse was large enough, and the bathroom was repaired to the innermost point. Usually, even if someone came at the door, they couldn't hear their whining at all. It's just a little inconvenient to take a shower and go to the toilet. While dragging Chen Wei, suddenly, a cell phone rang. Lin and picked up the phone and saw that it was Chen Hui's phone. The name displayed by the caller made him suddenly stunned. Caller ID, Yin Xiao Xiao. Asterisk. Lin and turned to look at Chen Wei, and pulled the tape off his mouth, who is this? You owe me money, and I'm collecting debts these days. Chen Wei looked terrified, for fear that Lin and thought he had tipped off and angered him. Lin and glanced at him blankly, tell Yin Xiao Xiao to give her 10 days to repay the debt. Chen Wei nodded hurriedly, and Lin and clicked the connect button and the public release on the phone. On the phone, a glutinous female voice sounded, Chen, brother Chen. I, I want to give a few more days of grace, these few days, I. She spoke with a slightly pitiful cry in her voice. Okay, I'll give you another 10 days, okay. Chen Wei swallowed, his voice trembling. Yin Xiao Xiao on the phone obviously didn't expect him to say such a thing, and after a stunned moment, she quickly thanked, Thank you brother Chen, I, I really have no choice lately, my mother's medicine is finished, and in the shop where I work, the boss but he said he was going to postpone the salary, I, I. Listening to Yin Xiao Xiao's flustered explanation, without hanging up the phone for a while, a dazed hope suddenly rose in Chen Hui's heart, if I ask for help now. The moment he almost popped the idea in his head, he implemented it. Help, I'm in a suburban warehouse. Linen knocked him over with a punch, leaving him lying on the ground with his eyes dazed. He rolled his eyes, but he didn't take Chen Hui's act of death to heart. Isn't this guy stupid? Wasn't he pretty smart just now? He didn't even think about it, who is this asking for help? If I am really a kidnapper, just like you, I will definitely be the first to use it as a sacrifice to the sky. It's just such a disgrace, and the big brother in the rivers and lakes, pull over. 
Yin Xiao Xiao on the phone was startled by the sudden call for help, and for a while, she didn't dare to speak out. Lin and took the mobile phone, and her tone was calm. Yin Xiao Xiao, right. His voice fell, and there was a cry like a cry from the other side of the phone. I, I, I didn't hear anything. Yin Xiao Xiao's voice came from the telephone, with a pleading, I really don't know anything. Lin An's voice was gentle, don't be afraid, listen to me. On the other end of the phone, Yin Xiao Xiao was left with the sobbing sound that was suppressed as much as possible. Chen Wei is not a good thing, you and I both know it in our hearts. I didn't think about what to do to him, or even if I did, it would only be good for you and not bad. Starting today, you don't have to think that someone will collect debts from you. You can pretend that no one made this call today, and no one will bother you because of this. You just have to live your life and leave this scumbag alone, okay? Maybe it was Lin An's gentle tone that made her relax a little bit, but there was a few trembling hums from Yin Xiaoxiao on the other end of the phone. I was just bullied by him. I had no choice but to fight back. It wasn't a bad guy, and I didn't plan to do anything to him. I just wanted him not to trouble me. Don't think about it, and don't make up your own mind. If you encounter any problems these days, just make this call, okay? After Lin and finished speaking, on the other end of the phone, Yin Xiaoxiao heard a few soft and weak words, I, I know, I won't make trouble for myself. But, but, don't do stupid things. For the sake of a few bad guys, no, not worth it. Lin and smiled dumbly, understood, you don't have to worry, hang up the phone, just do whatever you want. Before Yin Xiaoxiao could reply, Lin and hung up the phone. He sealed Chen Hui's mouth again, and deliberately tied him a few more times before throwing it into the bathroom. Unlucky. But Lin and has nothing to worry about, he has already tested the consequences of doing so in a simulated way before the simulator starts today. As a result, even until the end of the day, no one cares about these scumbags. In their bathroom, they became zombies at the moment of the end of the day. Lin and threw the phone on the table, sat on the sofa, and started a few simulations. During the free time, he used the fitness equipment to exercise. All the time arrangements were the same as before. I went to bed at 12 o'clock in the evening, woke up at 5.30 in the morning full of energy, and after the morning exercise, took the gangsters out, took a bath in the bathroom to solve the problem, and threw them back to the bathroom. Five days left. Lin and sighed, after today, he only had five days left to relax. Counting today, that is, after six days of peace, all these peaceful days will never return. After eating breakfast, Lin and concentrated on exercising, using the simulator to obtain information while waiting for the simulator to refresh. The golden talent is elusive, and he can only try his best to calm down. There are still six opportunities to fix his talent, and things will not always be this way. Turning on the phone and starting the projection, Linen looked at the file Lu Yao sent him. Details of Lonely Island. Closed double angle bracket. Yesterday, Lu Yao sent him this information. He didn't read the dozens of pages of documents. Linen looked at this document bit by bit, and his understanding of the Lonely Island became deeper and deeper. It's a good thing to stay away from the inland. After arriving at the end city pier, you can get there by boat in five hours, and the distance is still moderate. The only thing to consider is that there may also be tricky mutant animals in the sea. There are sufficient materials and land that can be cultivated. Although the area is not large, hundreds of people are self-sufficient and can have a surplus. Not to mention, there are also fishery resources. I just don't know if the fishery in this sea can continue to be done when the end comes. The power generation facilities in the interior are relatively complete, and the only thing to worry about is the fuel problem. However, the internal facilities of N City are complete, and there are coal mines nearby. Both thermal power and wind power can provide basic electricity. The island is still being repaired, and there are a lot of building materials and equipment hoarded. There are not many buildings, but after cleaning, it is enough to live in. Linen passed the information in his hand little by little, and the information of Gujo Island became clearer and clearer in his heart. He also called up the map on his mobile phone and downloaded a copy specially, so that he would not be able to use it if he lost the internet in the future. On the other hand, it was recorded on paper with a hand pen. Although the road to N-City is a bit long, it's good luck. 
It just happens that the highway and train line in J city can be used as an alternative. If you want to go to N city, in addition to the county where I am located, you have to clear the roads near J city and S city. After the two cities have cleared the passageway, they can go directly to city N via highway number. 72. Although it is a little farther, the number of zombies on the road should be limited. The road conditions are definitely bad, and probably still have to use motorcycles as the main means of mobility. If you want to use the train line, Linen thoughtfully sketched the line while thinking carefully about the gains and losses brought about by this choice. The advantage of choosing Lonely Island as the base for Doomsday survival is undoubtedly safety, which can avoid conflicts with mainstream mutants, zombies, and animals. It is worth worrying about the mutant animals in the sea. If it is difficult to solve, it is easy to be trapped or difficult to supply. I didn't get any news about the ocean in the simulation, presumably because I never thought of going this route before. Try it out today. In the simulation, the simulation is carried out with the goal of Lonely Island, and the problems that may be encountered on the way can be solved slowly. At around 11 o'clock in the morning, when Linen felt a little craving for lunch, Harry, who had been guarding the door outside the warehouse, suddenly barked. Linen picked up the pistol contributed by Chen Wei, and suddenly got up and leaned towards the warehouse door. There are strangers. The Beast Whisperer's talent came into play, and Harry's simple warning provided Chen in with information. Several people. Linen asked, and with the help of Beast Whisperer, his words were also understood by Harry. A man. A woman. Harry barked, briefly stating the message. Linen pushed open the door. So, I saw a thin girl, barked by Harry, too scared to move, with tears in her eyes, standing beside Chen Hui's black car, trembling slightly. Her black hair was a bit messy and covered half of her cheeks, her peach blossom eyes were filled with water mist, and her originally fair face was now even more pale with fright, and the white sneakers under the old jeans were still a little dirty. I, I. She wanted to speak, but she couldn't utter a complete sentence of nervousness. Tears fell unconsciously, and she begged for mercy in a very frightened tone, I was just passing by. Linen chuckled, do you believe this yourself, Yin Xiao Xiao? As Linen uttered her name in one sentence, Yin Xiao Xiao took two steps back unconsciously, her legs softened, she tripped over a small stone, and sat on the ground with her buttocks. Okay, come here, come in, come in and talk. Linen opened the warehouse door unconcernedly and raised his chin towards Harry. Go ahead and play, don't worry about her. Harry stopped barking, Hachi Hachi stuck out his tongue, sniffed at Yin Xiao Xiao's feet, and then went to have fun at the edge of the warehouse. It was chasing its tail and going around in circles, and it could play with itself, until sleepy. Why, you are so courageous that you dare to come to me alone, and you are afraid to come in and sit. Linen looked at Yin Xiao Xiao's cowardly look, a little funny. You're so timid, why did you come over by yourself? Don't you tell her what to do. Still, that sentence. Come all come. If it's convenient, take her with you when the apocalypse begins. When she can evolve, it will save herself from having to go to the gathering place to find her to play the hero save the beauty. Could it be that this is also a display of serious talent? Unlucky to encounter the trouble of Chen Wei but then encounter a future evolutionary who sent it over for nothing. If you think about it, it doesn't seem impossible. Yin Xiaoxiao got up in a panic, but found that Lin and really didn't worry about escaping at all, or in other words, she didn't care what choices she made at all. She wanted to slip away, but she didn't know what she remembered. After a while, she gathered up her courage, took her steps, and walked into the warehouse with a large open door with a kind of generosity. At this moment, Linen is just a gesture of meeting an old acquaintance, sitting comfortably on the sofa with his legs on the coffee table, using his mobile phone to continue sorting out information related to Lonely Island, and from time to time he writes down in a notebook on the side, something. Yin Xiaoxiao walked staggeringly and sat on the small sofa beside Linen with difficulty. Tone Nuo Nuo's opening, that, I, I'm not here to make trouble. I know, you are here for nothing. As soon as Lin An's words came out, Yin Xiaoxiao sat on the sofa as hard as wax, and her mind went blank. Asterisk. Lin An just hummed in a funny way and glanced at her sideways. She was 1.6 meters tall and tried to sit up straight, but she also looked small on the sofa. Tell me, what are you doing here? 
Linen asked casually while finishing the things at hand, how did you come here? I heard what Chen Wei said yesterday, suburban warehouses, and I thought that there are not many warehouses in the suburbs of our county, and I saw Chen Hui's car, so I. She explained carefully. Yin's little fingers tangled together, feeling a little complicated in her heart. She didn't know whether she should be glad that Linen looked kind, or she should regret why she couldn't hold back and wanted to intervene in this matter. I'm not here to make trouble. It's just. She didn't dare to speak her heart out come. Linen glanced at her again, and the mind reader played a role. After reading her somewhat confused thoughts, she guessed and asked, I'm worried that I'm actually a bad person, right? I'm worried that I won't do what you say on the surface, but kill them all behind my back. If I'm a bad person, but you help me hide it, you'll become a helper, so I feel uneasy, right? After Lin and finished speaking, Yin Xiaoxiao followed his words, but her eyes widened. In the end, she shrank into a ball in fear and couldn't sit up straight anymore. I was thinking about secretly seeing what's going on. If I'm a bad person, I'll report to Jing to arrest me. When Lin and said this, Yin Xiaowei was about to cry. How does he know everything? Linen couldn't help laughing a few times. You're so brave, you never thought about it. If I were really a bad person, if I ran into you, I would just silence you. Yin Xiaoxiao was afraid to look at him. You, you're not a bad person. Dot are you. She really didn't expect that she just found Chen Hui's car, and when she got close, she wanted to take a sneak peek, and was found by the dog. Before he could even run, he was caught. However, she didn't just come here without any preparations. So she mustered up her courage. When I was leaving, I told my friends that if I didn't see me in the afternoon, I would report to Jing. Linen snorted and swept her eyes up and down. Then if I lock you up now, severely punish, torture, find out who your friend is, and deal with her before she reports to Jing in the afternoon. Well, what do you do? Or, I simply kill you in a hurry and run away now, what should I do? Aren't you afraid of death? After Lin and finished speaking, Yin Xiaoxiao was even more frightened, and her tears fell on her knees. Then don't kill me, okay? When you called yesterday, I, I felt that you were still alive. Pretty good. Is this old girl too stupid? To be able to live for more than 10 days at the end of the day is really amazing enough. But in another sense, she is really powerful. She is so timid, but because she is worried that she will help the bad guys, she dares to look at the situation in person. I really don't know whether to call her brave or cowardly. Is this the so-called ruthless character who can, cry the knifeman? Linen then thought about the information he had seen in the simulator. In the end, Yin Xiaoxiao acted alone several times, and every time he fought side by side, there was no despicable behavior of fleeing, basically belonging to an excellent fighter who can fight to the death. With her character, in the face of those terrifying monsters, she was able to summon the courage to fight, and even dare to do all kinds of dangerous things with herself. Did this guy become strong because of what happened when the apocalypse came, or was he soft on the outside and tough on the inside, looking weak, but deep in his bones, he had a fighting spirit that was far beyond ordinary people. Linen suddenly became interested in her and wanted to know where the courage and ability of this seemingly soft and cowardly girl came from. Okay, let's play with you. Although Linen thinks that she looks cute with a crying and pitiful bag, she doesn't deliberately scare people into crying to satisfy her own bad taste. What kind of person she is, for Linen, it only takes a day or two of contact to figure out what kind of person she is. I didn't kill anyone, and I'm not interested in you. If you want to see how Chen Wei is doing, you can go there. Linen pointed to the bathroom. Yin Xiaoxiao followed his fingers and saw the bathroom with the door locked, and stammered, he, are they in there? Yes. After Lin and finished speaking, he simply got up, walked to the edge of the bathroom, opened the door, and motioned to Yin Xiaoxiao. Yin Xiaoxiao got up and walked to the vicinity, looking in from the open door from a distance, she saw a group of gangsters tied up, and after seeing her, her mouth covered with tape still whimpered a few times. Lin and closed the door again with a snap, and said, lock them up for a few days, and then send them home if they're honest, lest they have to convene people to retaliate against me when they go back. You, you are like this, they go back and report to Jing. Yin Xiaoxiao saw that Lin and really didn't seem like a bad person. Even if he was discovered by him, 
he didn't do anything to himself, and he felt a little more at ease. Lin and simply made a few words, they also came out to mess with others. They found trouble with others. Instead, they were tied up and taught a lesson for several days. They went back and reported to Jing. How will they mess around in the future? But, Yin Xiaoxiao wanted to say something, but Lin and raised her eyebrows, are you encouraging me to solve them all to avoid future troubles? No, no, she waved her hands excitedly. Lin and shook his head, anyway, it's my business. After six days, I'll let them go. If I'm caught, I'll be unlucky. I'll take responsibility for what I did. Yin Xiaoxiao was speechless for a moment, and what the other party said also made sense. They were all adults, and if they did bad things, they naturally had to bear it by themselves. Linen stretched out her hand and rubbed her already messy hair even more before she shivered, trembled, trembling, trembling away. Little boy, don't think about it all day, just do things that have nothing to do with you. Don't come close. I'm 24. She finished weakly, but that face looked like a high school student anyway. Have you eaten? Linen asked suddenly. Yin Xiaoxiao let out a sigh and raised her head with a dazed expression. Linen got the answer from her heart. Okay. It's fine without eating. Linen hooked her fingers, and she followed Linen confusedly. It wasn't until she got on the back seat of Lin An's motorcycle that she said in a wrong voice, I want to go home to eat. Sit down and eat barbecue. Linen didn't give her the right to choose at all. Yin Xiaoxiao wanted to refute, but the motorcycle had already started, and the rumbling sound of the engine engulfed her in audible protests. For this cowardly and brave girl, Linen has temporarily figured out a few ways. As long as she doesn't touch the moral bottom line that she adheres to in her heart, she will be completely cowardly. And it is not a bad thing for Linen that an individual can stick to his inner moral bottom line. Everyone should have something they must stick to, maybe justice, maybe family, friendship, love. If there is nothing in a person's heart to hold on to, then he can never be trusted. Yin Xiaoxiao's character is not annoying to him, as long as the morality and justice she adheres to are not imposed on others, and she does not force others to do things according to her ideas, then she wants to be a good person worthy of her conscience girl, what's wrong with that? Just like even if she felt that what Linen did was not right, but when Linen explained that he would bear all the consequences, she gave up persuasion. As long as Linen kept his promise and was willing to let him go in a few days, she would not let him go. Jing will be reported. As for kidnapping this group of people for a few days. Maybe in her heart, she always hopes that if someone can teach this group of villains a lesson, she just thinks that they are not guilty of death, and is afraid that Linen will kill them, is at risk alone. When she got to the kebab shop, Linen didn't give her a chance to run away. With a glance, she let her follow him in obediently. She couldn't eat anymore until Linen just had the appetizer. She could only sit carefully and watch Linen eat. She took out her phone from time to time and looked at the time. Is something wrong? Linen glanced at her. I have to go home and cook for my mother. Then she said that she still had something to do. Then go, call another day. Linen didn't give her a chance to refuse, took out her mobile phone, and after exchanging contact information with her, waved her hand to let her leave. It wasn't until she walked out of the barbecue shop that Yin Xiaoxiao finally breathed a long sigh of relief, rubbed her eyes with a bitter face. She turned her head and saw that there was only smoke in the barbecue shop, and she couldn't see the man sitting in the corner. Lin En. She whispered his name softly, and it was not until now that she dared to come to a conclusion, he is a good person. Just turned around, and became a little more distressed. What if those bad guys were later let go by him and troubled him again? What if Jing caught him? I don't know, is it an accomplice? She left in distress, but didn't dare to bother him anymore. God bless you, good people will be rewarded. Yin Xiaoxiao prayed silently, but hurriedly accelerated her pace, she had to go home to cook for her mother. And Linen, alone, ate at 2 o'clock in the afternoon at the barbecue restaurant. I have to say that this kind of barbecue restaurant is a bit troublesome for the current Linen, the roast is slow, and he eats too much. At two o'clock in the afternoon, Linen rubbed his hands and breathed a sigh of relief. Today's simulation goal, the first one, is to bring everyone around, including Zhang Qingshui's friend Liao and Yin Xiaoxiao. By the way, Yin Xiaoxiao also has a mother who depends on each other. 
She doesn't seem to be in good health, so let's take it with you to see. If the doomsday comes, if she can remain a zombie, she will not affect her actions, help arrange a, a good place. Then, today's goal is to visit Lonely Island and see if you can find a way out on Lonely Island. Of course, if it is more difficult, go to other gathering places and try to prolong the survival time. Where can I survive as long as I can? After Lin and imagined it, he opened the emulator. However, this time, a golden light made him suddenly short of breath. I drop a darling, which Bodhisattva did this help? The first, the first simulation, there is a golden talent. The smile on Lin An's face grew deeper and deeper. What a talent. Absolutely great talent. Tianyantong, golden, you can see through your eyes and can see information about anything. The greater the gap between you and the other party's spiritual power, the more information you can see. Close black lens bracket. Although this talent is followed by a mysterious word, spiritual power, for the current Lin An. But this innate ability still makes Lin An extremely happy. What is the concept of being able to see each other's information? This means that if Lin An sees a mutant, he will know what the opponent's ability is without using his hands. If the talent is stronger, he can even see the opponent's weakness. You must know that the reason why Lin An has been killed by mutants in the simulation many times these days is that he does not know what the other party has. Looking at the mutant who played with sand like Gara, but instead of burying him in the entire sand waterfall, he secretly buried sand in his lungs, and finally suffocated to death. The mutants who look like they control plants are actually secretly controlling the seeds of plants. As long as they fall on them, they will burrow into the flesh and grow flowers on your arms. Looking at the honest and honest hidden, at first glance it is a ghost-shaped mutant zombie with low combat power, but in fact it is a master of frontal combat. Besides, it was like a mutant zombie in a small county town morgue, who seemed to be sleeping but woke up, even a building in the hospital was about to collapse, and a mutant mouse who was weak but was good at digging holes to hide. Too many deaths are due to Lin An's lack of intelligence. It can be said that as long as Lin An gets this talent early, even if it is just a combination of the talent martial god and this heavenly eyesight both talents can allow him to easily eliminate these enemies in the early stage. Locked. Without saying a word, Lin An started to simulate. Open black lens bracket doomsday simulator has been opened close black lens bracket. Currently optional talents, omitted. The current talents are as follows. Martial God Golden, you are very sensitive to martial arts, you are self-taught in combat, your physical fitness is extremely high, and your progress is extremely rapid. Close black lens bracket. Serious Gold, your fate is unknown, and the fate of Sirius means that you are destined to accompany killing and plundering in this life. Whenever you kill, you will get a little gain, and may even plunder the opponent's ability, but fortunately misfortunes depend on each other, and you will also encounter more crises than ordinary people. Close black lens bracket. Mind reader, purple, you are very good at reading other people's hearts and seeing the real side of them under their disguised masks. Close black lens bracket. Beast whisperer, purple, you are naturally able to read the voices of animals and communicate with them. Close black lens bracket. Tianyantong, golden, you can see through your eyes and can see information about anything. The greater the gap between you and the other party's spiritual power, the more information you can see. Close black lens bracket. Cool. What is a monster panel? Lin and happily looked at his panel, not to mention how comfortable he was. This simulation, maybe it will be able to simulate a hundred days later. It happened that the golden talent was released in the first shot today, and I am not afraid of living too long, and the cooling time of the simulator is too long. But when Lin and saw the first day of the simulator, his joy suddenly became heavy. Day 1, you were already prepared and stayed in the warehouse with your friends. The moment the doomsday came, you found that Yin Xiaoxiao's mother suddenly vomited blood, lay on the ground, and fell into the struggle of mutating into a zombie. After she briefly narrated her last words, you followed her will and broke her neck with your own hands before she turned into a zombie. Yin Xiaoxiao was sobbing silently, while Zhang Qingxie and your dog were already in a coma, and Lu Yao was silent. After you threw a group of gangsters in the bathroom out of the warehouse, you had a sad day. Close black lens bracket. Yin Xiaoxiao's mother is dead. Lin An was silent for a moment, and after a while, he sighed. There's nothing he can do about this. 
He didn't know the reason why humans became zombies, and he didn't know how to stop all this. He was a little sad when he thought of Yin Xiaoxiao's uneasy look when he was thinking of his mother when he left today. He may already know why Yin Xiaoxiao was so strong in the previous simulation, and why he didn't pull back when fighting with him. Maybe it was because she had witnessed the tragic scene of her mother turning into a zombie. Poor girl. The next day, the army appeared, and you held on to it. After the army left, you went out alone and picked up a rifle covered by a corpse. Go to the hospital. After a battle, you find the sleeping mutant zombie from the morgue, but you can see that it is currently in a state of mutant evolution through talent. After you have judged, use a rifle to shoot it to the head, its mental explosion is stillborn, you find that there is a baby that has become a mutant zombie in its belly, solve it in advance, and luckily trigger it Sirius has acquired a talent that can continuously enhance his spiritual power. Close black lens bracket. Lin An's eyes narrowed. Actually, there is a mutant zombie. Why had he never seen him before? Is it trapped in the ground? Moreover, this talent in mutant zombies is really tyrannical, it is not used for fighting, but a passive talent used to enhance spiritual power. Could it be that the reason why this mutant zombie is so strong is because of the mutant zombie in its stomach? Linen was sighed, and at the same time, she was a little excited by the power of the new talent Tianyantong, really powerful. Not only can you see the status and abilities of these mutant zombies, but you can even see some details that he usually can't see. Linen thought for a moment and suddenly couldn't wait. After the simulation is over, I solidify Tianyantong on my own body. Can I see other humans' information directly? If possible, can we use Zhang Qingxie and Yin Xiaoxiao as templates to find out the differences between them and other humans, so as to find out the humans that may evolve in advance? Linen was suddenly a little excited you must know that at the moment when the end came, how many humans who would not have turned into zombies unexpectedly became the food of these monsters. And how many of these human beings killed and swallowed by monsters have the possibility of evolution. Assuming that there are thousands of people in a human gathering place, according to the intelligence in the simulation, at least a few people can become evolutionaries in the future. And now, doesn't the county where Lin and is located also has a population of 10 or 200,000? Suppose that more than half of them will become zombies, but among the remaining tens of thousands, let alone, there are a dozen or more future evolutionaries who died before evolution arrived, right? Those who meet their own recruitment criteria, not to mention seven or eight, even if one or two more people can do it. Can't your team be stronger by a few points? Hiss. Tianyantong, don't let me down. The third day, when you were cleaning up the zombies in the city, you encountered a group of mutant rats without incident. You and Zhang Qingxie were prepared to cooperate, and successfully lured the hidden rat king out and beheaded them. Close black lens bracket. Tisk. This time I didn't get the rat group talent, is it really random? It seems that I must get a whole, a lucky talent in the future. Before, Linen had seen many common talents such as, lucky, blue, and the instructions in it would enhance his luck to varying degrees. Perhaps, as long as he can find a purple or even golden luck type talent, his serious talent will definitely become a growth-shaped fighting talent even stronger than that of the Valkyrie. Day 4 you took a rest and decided to act alone to get through the passage to J City. Close black lens bracket. Day 5, you successfully touched the surroundings of City J. After observing for a day, you decided to go back first. Close black lens bracket. Sixth day, you suddenly found that Lu Yao had passed out with a high fever. After a long time, when she was awake, she became an evolutionary person who could create low temperature, condense ice out of thin air, and let her be driven. With joy, you began to hone Lu Yao's fighting skills with Zhang Qingxie. Close black lens bracket. Lin An couldn't help but snorted. Lu Yao, is he also awakened? Lin An's brows gradually wrinkled, lost in thought, is it pure luck? Or is it, that it actually represents some kind of connection? Suppose Zhang Qingxie evolved because of a certain factor, and Lu Yao evolved because of this. What did they have in common? Lin An suddenly had the urge to call Zhang Qingxie now to ask about Lu Yao's information, but in the end he suppressed this idea for a while, and decided to wait until the golden talent was solidified before going to her. Seventh day, you and Zhang Qingxie go to J City together to clean up the mutants in it. 
Close black lens bracket. The eighth day, you caught a few mutants without any risk, and then started to clean up the mutant zombies in the city. Close black lens bracket. Day 9, you return to the county seat. Close black lens bracket. Day 10, you plan to start, start to go to Lonely Island, and move the entire team to J-City. Close black lens bracket. Day 11, you are in J-City for the final rectification. Close black lens bracket. Day 12, you set foot on the JS Highway and move forward slowly. Close black lens bracket. The 13th day, after Yin Xiaoxiao had a fever, she successfully became an evolutionary person. You tried to make her make some food, but she actually made her a piece of edible bread, and she had a strong sense of satiety. Wonderful about it. Close black lens bracket. Day 14, the road to S City is still far away. Close black lens bracket. Day 15, you discovered a group of excellent mutant apes hidden on the edge of the road ahead of time. You speculate that the situation in City S is not friendly. After the battle, you try to eat mutant animals. Your eyes tell you that the flesh and blood of these mutant animals is quite nutritious, but the taste of these monkeys gives you a headache. Close black lens bracket. Day 16, you arrived at City S, but unexpectedly discovered that there are neither zombies nor mutants wandering in this city, but a group of mutated animals with a great variety and abundance. They cooperated with each other, and even abandoned the simple racial concept and hunted zombies together. You speculate that there must be a powerful mutant animal commanding them in S-City. Close black lens bracket. Day 17, you try to communicate with animals and find that they are really willing to talk to you. You saw an incomparably huge lion, and it gave you the feeling that it was very dangerous, but after communicating with him, he actually obtained the right of way walked through the city leisurely, and set foot on the number. 72 Highway. Go to N City. Close black lens bracket. Day 18, your journey is very smooth. Close black lens bracket. Day 19, you suddenly encountered an ambush. Fortunately, your eyes sensed the ambush for you in advance. It turned out to be a group of evolutionaries trying to rob you. In the battle, their strange abilities caused you a lot of trouble, but your team was sturdy in combat and after paying the price of Yin Xiaoxiao being seriously injured, the regiment destroyed the opponent. You have acquired the ability to control sound waves, you can use echo detection, or send out harsh sound waves to attack, attack the enemy, and you can even hear the noisy sound of what seems to be an electrical network. Close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket day 20, you rest in place and wait for Yin Xiaoxiao to recover. Close black lens bracket. Day 21. Yin Xiaoxiao reluctantly recovered, and you continue on your way. Close black lens bracket. Day 22, the motorcycle is broken, but fortunately, Yin Xiaoxiao can repair it. Her ability to achieve almost everything she wants makes you feel very amazing. Close black lens bracket. 23rd day, the road is blocked, and the bad road conditions around you give you a headache. Fortunately, you have Lu Yao, she created a glacier to cross the obstacle, and you continue to move forward. Close black lens bracket. Day 24, you finally arrived in City N, but the quiet atmosphere in the city made you feel very strange. You stayed still and temporarily found a place to observe. Close black lens bracket. Day 25, at midnight, your dog noticed something unusual. You went out to observe and unexpectedly discovered a group of murlocs, who cooperated to hunt and kill zombies wandering in the city. You tried to communicate, but the murlocs rushed towards you violently, and you slaughtered them. Early in the morning, you went to the beach to observe, only to see the dangers in the ocean. Close black lens bracket. 26th day, you try to find a boat that can be used. Fortunately, there are several fishing boats. Although there is no key, you have Yin Xiaoxiao, and you will soon become a boat. You go to the coast alone to scout. Suddenly, you use the sonic ability acquired by Sirius to detect a huge shadow, and after running away, the ship is dragged into the seabed by a huge tentacle. You stand on the shore, helpless. Close black lens bracket. The 27th day, you tried to solve the tentacle monster in the ocean with your teammates, but did not capture the other party's figure. Close black lens bracket. Day 28. You and your teammates used fishing boats to wander along the coast again, but the tentacle monster did not appear. Close black lens bracket. Day 29. 
After discussing with your teammates, you decided to give it a try and head towards Lonely Island. During the process, your sound waves caught the sudden appearance of a huge tentacle monster. You and your teammates fought hard, but failed to gain an advantage in the naval battle, and the tentacle monster took the opportunity to smash the ship. Lu Yao froze a layer of ice, and you barely supported it. Yin Xiaoxiao tried to build a boat, but she couldn't do it, so she only built a life raft. In the end, you and Zhang Qingxie fought the tentacle monster in the deep sea. After Zhang Qingxie paid an arm, you won the final victory. Close black lens bracket. The 30th day, you successfully used the life raft made by Yin Xiaoxiao and arrived at Guzhou Island by means of manpower paddling. Close black lens bracket. Day 31, you have cleared the scattered zombies and animals on the road and settled down temporarily. Close black lens bracket. Day 32, you got in touch with the land near Guzhou Island through the radio. Close black lens bracket. 33rd day, you found that there are many murlocs wandering around the island. Close black lens bracket. Day 34, you solved these murlocs. Close black lens bracket. 35th day, Large-scale murlocs rushed out of the bottom of the sea and landed on the shore. Your team fought heroically to defeat the murlocs. Close black lens bracket. 36th day, calm and calm, you feel, feel safe. Close black lens bracket. Day 37, Yin Xiaoxiao made food, and you celebrate Lu Yao's birthday together. Close black lens bracket. 38th day, at night, you saw Zhang Qingxie who was alone looking at the sea and holding a broken arm. After some conversation, you slept in her room. Close black lens bracket. 39th day, you received a distress signal from near N city, and a large group of terrifying murlocs attacked them. Close black lens bracket. 40th day, you decided to lend a helping hand, build a wooden boat and return to land, but it was too late, only a piece of ruins and corpses were found. Close black lens bracket. Day 41, you are trying to return to Lonely Island but suddenly there are countless murlocs stepping on the waves to attack you. After the battle, you can only be forced to return to N city. Close black lens bracket. 42nd day, you noticed that the number of murlocs was increasing, thinking that it would be very difficult to cross the sea, so you had to give up going to Guzhou Island and temporarily stationed in N city. Close black lens bracket. 43rd day, the number of murlocs is increasing. After you judge, it will become more and more difficult to go to Lonely Island. Finally, you decide to go to a gathering place near the capital to obtain shelter. Close black lens bracket. Day 44, hurry up. Close black lens bracket. Linen frowned. Murloc. Linen was lost in thought. It's not that these murlocs are difficult to deal with. In fact, on land, Linen judged that their combat effectiveness is very ordinary, so they can only use human sea tactics to grind people. However, because he lacked the ability to fly, he could only use sea traffic to go to Lonely Island, which made this group of murlocs a bit difficult. Four or five hours of sailing time, if you can't rely on the boat, the group of murlocs will queue up to die, and they will be exhausted in the sea. It seems that this Lonely Island, if it doesn't work, just give up. Linen sank and continued to watch the simulation. For the next time, Linen continued to watch the simulation. However, the more I looked, the more frightened I became. The process of his joining the capital gathering place went smoothly, but soon, mutants and mutant zombies began to gather, forming a huge corpse tide. On the 50th day, nearly half of the country's gathering places fell. In 60 days, humans were forced to start joining forces. On the 70th day, the surviving human beings merged into four major gathering places to resist the corpse tide. On the 80th day, the situation gradually stabilized, the zombies seemed to have been beaten and hurt, the mutants were also honest, and the humans got a temporary respite. However, when the simulator arrived on its 90th day, Linen is still dead. His eyes trembled slightly, and the fingers holding the pen and paper to record the information unconsciously squeezed the black carbon pen into two pieces. After a while, only one word popped out. Grass. The 90th day, there was a sudden commotion in the gathering place. As the team leader of the evolutionary people, you soon got a piece of news that made you extremely frightened. The nuclear button is out of control. You don't know the specific reason, but you only know that at this moment, 
99% of the world's nuclear weapons have entered a state of mutual strikes, and they flew high into the sky according to the originally set strike procedure. After a few minutes, you see a huge mushroom cloud. You are dead. Close black lens bracket. Grass. Linen threw the banknotes aside, his face ashen. Global nuclear bomb out of control, full coverage nuclear strike. This is the end of the day is so fun, isn't it? Asterisk. Solid talent. Close black lens bracket. Lin An's eyes were faintly hot. He covered his eyes, tears flowed from his eyes unconsciously, and when he wanted to open his eyes, he just felt hot, as if he couldn't bear to be contaminated with chili peppers. Lin An endured and remained silent. After a few minutes, the stinging heat wave subsided from his eyes, and instead, a refreshing feeling appeared, which made his eyes seem to have been dry for a long time and then drip with a drop of eye drops. Instantly comfortable. He opened it slowly, wiped away the tears, and in these few minutes, he calmed down his mood by the way. Linen doesn't know what others will do, whether they can do better than him after facing the fact that the end is coming, but he knows very well that he has done his best. There are five days left. He breathed a sigh of relief. Isn't it just a nuclear bomb? Piece of cake. Hem, little question. Linen tried to comfort himself that after the nuclear bomb fell, at least most of those zombies should be dead. It should be easier to simply deal with a post-nuclear world than to deal with those terrifying messy monsters, right? These nuclear bombs did not wash the earth again, they just attacked the major cities in the world according to the original procedure. As long as they find a remote place that is not the location of the attack, what he needs to deal with is nothing more than nuclear winter and other trivial matters. That's it. After humans become evolutionaries, maybe they are not afraid of nuclear radiation anymore. But at the same time, Linen also realized that his simulation today probably won't gain much. The self in the simulation did not know there was such a thing as a nuclear bomb. After over and over again, there was a high probability that he would eventually be sent away by a sudden, surprise. At this moment, Linen raised his head, only to realize that the surrounding situation seemed a little wrong. He hasn't left the kebab shop yet. After Luya left just now, he continued to eat two points to refresh the simulator. As soon as he refreshed, he had a golden talent. Excited, he sat in the barbecue shop and watched the simulation. The waiter, who was watching this, Big Stomach King, from time to time, watched Lin An's face from time to time, and at the end he didn't know why his eyes were crying. Lin An's expression didn't change, he got up to check out and left, and left the store, but for a while, he no longer had any interest in going back to exercise. A little tired today, looking left and right, he decided to give himself a little, take a break, to study the power of the newly solidified, Tianyantong. He leaned on his motorcycle and looked at the passers-by around him, and at this moment, the cured Tianyantong began to play a role. Ordinary human male, with a physical age of 29 years old and an actual age of 21 years old, weak-willed and lethargic. Close black lens bracket. Linen casually looked at a passing young man, and information about him gradually emerged in his eyes. The longer Linen stared at him, the more words appeared afterward. The will to survive is low. Close black lens bracket. No special skills. Close black lens bracket. Evolution possibility. Low. Alteration probability. High. Linen looked away. Then, he couldn't help but twitch his lips. It really works. Linen found that this day's vision is also a spiritual ability, as long as he wants to know the information, it will surface in front of him. However, the efficiency is not very high. He stared at the young man for several seconds before seeing the last few key messages from him. Just like Tianyantong needs a scan time, the longer the scan time, the more information you can see. Linen let go of his thinking and let the ability of Tianyantong come into play. As a result, Dense text appeared in front of him, erratic, as if the barrage setting was turned on on the video interface. A bicycle passes by, the front tire needs to be inflated, and the brakes may fail under emergency braking. Close black lens bracket. A child ran past with a balloon, the airtightness of the balloon needs to be improved, and it will be completely deflated after a few hours. Close black lens bracket. Looking down at his motorcycle, the parts are aging and need to be replaced, please replenish the diesel immediately. Close black lens bracket. 
At first glance, it seems that everything in the world is accompanied by instructions, as if it has come to a game world. Linen looked around casually, and the words floating in his eyes made him like a child who got a new toy, quite addicted. There is a one yuan coin in the sewer. Close black lens bracket. Please don't dig here, someone buried shit. Close black lens bracket. Interesting. After watching for a while, Linen withdrew his gaze, and with the thought of a move, many useless messages were automatically cancelled, and the world in front of him instantly became much cleaner. Then, Linen stretched out his hand and looked at himself. Linen, a powerful human being, that is, yourself. Perhaps, you should stop this self-indulgent behavior, because it doesn't make much sense. Close black lens bracket. Can't you see your special abilities? Linen temporarily gave up studying himself. Ding dong. A text message alert sounded suddenly from the phone. He took out his phone and checked the time, it was less than 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And the person who sent the message was Zhang Qingshe. My Miao Dao, has it arrived? Linen was a little surprised, didn't expect the efficiency to be so high. Simply, start the motorcycle, and rush directly to her martial arts gym. The motorcycle slowly stopped in front of the door of her martial arts hall. Inside the glass door, Zhang Qingshe, who was sitting near the counter, was holding his chin with one hand, looking out the window for some reason. Hearing the movement of the motorcycle, he looked towards the door, facing him. The two sides were still staring out the window, their lazy eyes, and they seemed to come to life in an instant. I don't know why, looking at those eyes, just now because of the simulation results, I have always been in a depressed mood, but suddenly it seems like the sky is clearing up. Linen slowly opened the door, looked at her, smiled and said softly, good afternoon. On the other hand, Zhang Qingxie just smiled reservedly, but there was an unconcealed joy in her eyes. She stood up, wearing another white dress that was slightly different from yesterday. Zhang Qingxue's eyebrows and eyes were curved, and her voice was as clear as spring water which was subconsciously soft, like the warmth of sunshine after snow. In the end, all her emotions turned into a simple sentence, good afternoon. Asterisk. 1. An excellent female, sex, human, with good physical fitness, strong willpower, and full of energy, but at this moment, she is in a complicated mood and seems to be interested in you. Close black lens bracket. Linen looked at her, smiled and did not speak, but in fact paid close attention to the words in front of her. The text in front of him jumped out slowly, and soon, all the news he wanted to know came out. She has a fairly good knife skills, although it is not worth mentioning to you. Close black lens bracket. Evolution possibility, very high. Close black lens bracket. Will to survive, high. Evolution success rate, very high. Variation possibility, low. Close black lens bracket. The heartbeat is accelerating, if you continue to watch her motionless, this state may continue to aggravate. Close black lens bracket. Cough. Linen retracted his line of sight. Miao Dao arrived. After Linen finished speaking, Zhang Qingxie breathed a sigh of relief when she saw him move away from his fiery gaze. Well, here we are. She got up and handed Linen several narrow and long express boxes placed under the counter. Linen didn't rush to open it, but smiled and said to her, Thank you, is the money you gave you enough? These things are not easy to deal with, right? A friend made it at cost price. Zhang Qingxie added, I'm not very familiar with it, but he. In short, that's it, he only charged for the materials. Lin An's mind reading skills came into play, and she had a thorough look at her somewhat vague mind. It turned out to be the suitor of teacher Xiao Zhang. Linen smiled and winked at her, is it a man? Well, I met before, but I didn't communicate much, just ordinary friends. She didn't know why she had to explain so much, but she didn't react until she finished speaking. She seemed, afraid of Lin An's misunderstanding. What's wrong with me? Zhang Qingxie had some headaches about her changes, but for some unknown reason, when she realized this, her cheeks turned slightly red. Linen stopped teasing her, but suddenly let out a sigh of relief. Do you mind buying me a cup of tea? After he finished speaking, Zhang Qingxie nodded instinctively, go upstairs. Linen smiled, thank you. The last time Linen just stayed at the door for a while and then left. Strictly speaking, this was the first time Linen visited her house. 
Zhang Qingxie hesitated for a while, and closed the door before going up. I don't want guests to come. Open the door, the size of the second floor is the same as the first floor, more than 100 square meters, and the decoration is still exquisite. There is a bag of unfinished snacks on the coffee table, and there are several pictures of Zhang Qingxie on the TV cabinet, all of which are pictures of winning prizes in martial arts competitions. It's clean, and there aren't too many feminine decorations. What's hanging on the wall is not a landscape painting, but a decorative knife. Sit down first, I'll make tea. Zhang Qingxie came in behind him, and she was a little embarrassed to see him looking at his home. Arranging him to sit down on the sofa, he quickly grabbed the snack bag on the coffee table and took it away, hurried to the kitchen. Linen couldn't help laughing because of this cute look, and the irritability in his heart seemed to have calmed down a lot. He looked out the window, the sparrows on the telephone poles were circling and chirping, and the old man on the street walked slowly on crutches, one after another, all kinds of men and women hurried. This used to only make people feel ordinary and ordinary, but in Lin An's eyes, it is extraordinarily warm. The sound of boiling water came from the kitchen, and Zhang Qingxue's back was busy with a hint of excitement. Lin An retracted his gaze, closed his eyes slowly, leaned on the back of the sofa, and enjoyed a moment of calmness lazily and tiredly. I really want to stop on such an ordinary day like this. When Zhang Qingxie came over with the teapot, seeing Lin An's eyes closed a little tiredly, he unconsciously relaxed his movements but it still made Lin An open his eyes. She put down the teapot, sat on the other side of the coffee table, squatted on the carpet, and said in a low voice, are you in a bad mood? Lin An just looked at her and smiled. Seeing you, it's much better. He also simply got off the sofa, sat on the carpet, leaned back against the sofa, and sat opposite Zhang Qingxie. Mr. Zhang, I want to ask you. He looked at Zhang Qingxie and said seriously, if the world is going to end tomorrow, and there are monsters everywhere that eat one person, what would you do? Zhang Qingxie didn't understand why he suddenly made this assumption, but he didn't question it, but thought quietly for a moment. Try to live. She gave a positive answer. Zhang Qingxie looked at Lin An and smiled slightly. I work hard to protect my friends, and then work hard to live together. Even if the world is full of monsters, I can always find a safe place and a new home. What do you want, do you want to protect? Lin An asked again. Zhang Qingxie was silent for a moment, then lowered her head unconsciously. Xiao Lu, she is my only friend. Then, it seems, there is no more. She hesitated, and finally was too embarrassed to spit out Lin An's name. Afraid of his questioning, Zhang Qingxie hurriedly changed the subject. Xiao Lu and I have known each other since we were very young. Like me, she is a child of a single parent family. She is like me. Her father died when she was a teenager. She moved around with relatives and went to college before she could have her own life. The two of us supported each other and agreed to return to this small county after graduating from university. In the end, it became what it is now. She should think so too, right? Linen suddenly asked, if you live to the end, there are only the two of you left in this world, what should you do? Zhang Qingxie thought for a while, and then calmly said, there's no other way, right? After all, if ordinary people like us really live in such a world and can live, it shouldn't be easy. Isn't it lucky enough to be able to live with my friends? After Zhang Qingxie finished speaking, she looked at Lin and asked suddenly, what about you? If the end of the world is coming, what are you going to do? Lin and looked at her and unconsciously clenched her fingers slightly. Probably, do everything possible to survive and be the last one to live. His attitude is very firm, and his tone is serious, I can't save everyone, and I can't be the savior of the world. What I can do is to live hard and be the one who survives to the end. He looked at Zhang Qingxie and blinked. Zhang Qingxie, if, I mean if. I may have the ability to save the lives of many people, but in the end, I only choose to live with a few people and live selfishly. Do you think I hate it? Linen asked, but unconsciously activated the ability of the mind reader, trying to see through her real thoughts. Zhang Qingxie just looked at him quietly and suddenly asked, who are those people? Have me, Lin and said frankly, maybe it's a few people who have the ability to survive. Quote dot 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 quote. Zhang Qingxie was silent for a moment, and suddenly, a burst of courage came from nowhere. 
This courage pushed her to ask with all her strength, I. Am I a capable person? The air seemed to be stagnant for a moment, and the two pairs of eyes looked at each other without avoiding each other, as if they wanted to see each other's true thoughts from it. Following Lin An's heavy nod, Zhang Qingxie laughed suddenly, as dazzling as snow suddenly flooded with sunlight. It's like the snow lotus that bloomed in the snow after breaking through all the burials brilliantly. Then don't hate it. After she finished speaking, even her ears were dyed red. Pick up the teapot and slowly fill a cup. Please have some tea. Linen took the teacup and blew lightly, if the end comes, we will definitely survive. Until the end, his tone was firm. Zhang Qingxie just smiled lightly and covered her teacup with both hands, only feeling that the hot tea was no match for the heat on her cheeks. I trust you. After a short silence for a few minutes, Linen finished drinking a cup of tea, raised his head, and said seriously, I'll drink here today. In a few days, I'll treat you to hot pot. Okay. Zhang Qingxie didn't hold back. At this time, she was still flying, and she couldn't calm down. Linen went downstairs, got on a motorcycle, tied the Miao Dao delivered by the courier to the back seat with a rope, and drove to the warehouse. After returning to the warehouse, he threw the Miao Dao aside. Linen took out his mobile phone and started crazy, crazy searching. Guide to survival in a post-nuclear one world. Linen rubbed his eyebrows, unable to speak for a long time. He has realized that once the nuclear war breaks out, what is the biggest difficulty for him? Nuclear winter. Even if Linen finds his own peach blossom garden, avoids all dangers, is not disturbed by any monsters, and is not within the range of explosions, he still has to face the many changes that will occur on the entire earth. For example, after the global washing of the ground, there may be several months long, Winter days, without sunlight, only endless haze and cold, plants will lose photosynthesis, and animals will die in a chain reaction. Radiation contaminates water sources and may face years, if not decades, of lack of drinking water. Even the farmland on Gujo Island will lose the meaning of cultivation, unless linen can find an indoor greenhouse that is enough to avoid radiation, and the greenhouse must have a water source and simulate sunlight to ensure photosynthesis. If it was just a simple human being to face this disaster, Linen felt that he should rest. But soon, he found a way. Yin Xiao Xiao. Linen pinned her hopes on this seemingly weak girl. In the simulation, Yin Xiao Xiao will evolve a very powerful ability, which can create things out of thin air, and even food can be made. As long as she is there, even if the end of the world, Ling Dong is approaching, and the world is plunged into darkness, she will not die because of food shortages. Lu Yao is equally important. She can create ultra-low temperature and condense water vapor in the air. In a sense, if she develops it well, can she create a suitable water source? This is not impossible. Linen remembers clearly that Zhang Qingxue's first mastery was just the same ability as telekinesis, but with continuous development, he could finally master a power that can make zombies insane. In addition, Linen also has a lot of hope. If I can use Sirius to find some monsters that control thunder and lightning, after killing them, I can generate electricity with my bare hands. Yin Xiao Xiao's creation, with the continuous enhancement of proficiency and ability, may have a greater role in the end. Linen even had a bold conjecture, if Yin Xiao Xiao's ability can be continuously enhanced, in a year or even two years later, can she make some machines? Even the technological machinery that exists in the future, but does not exist now. Rubbing a shelter with bare hands, is it possible? Linen tapped his chin lightly with his fingers, and his mind turned rapidly, quickly integrating the known information. Can you take all the people from the institute away? He suddenly had a bold idea. You must know that in the 30 or 40 days in the simulation, the researchers have already studied the evolutionary medicine. If you can master these talents, can you let them develop something based on evolutionary medicine to withstand nuclear radiation? or, to enhance the existing capabilities of the evolutionary. Is it possible to stop a nuclear war by yourself? Linen thought for a moment, and finally could only sigh. It's not impossible, but it can only be said that based on current information, his assumptions are meaningless, is this a natural disaster or a man-made disaster? Like where did the zombie virus come from, why did the world change in an instant? Like my own simulator, I can't tell the origin. You can only make a decision by yourself when the end comes. Prepare with both hands. 
On the one hand, find an absolutely safe base. Guzhou Island is a good choice. As long as the dangers on the ocean are solved, the isolated island is a natural refuge. The big deal, the worst case, is to take Yin Xiaoxiao and his party to get a small shelter on the island, self-sufficient, and survive the initial stage, that's all. Even 10 or 20 years can survive. Humanity may not be completely wiped out, and by then, it will just recover slowly. There is no need to be too pessimistic. The simulation is just a simulation. With my current ability, when the end of the world begins and the information is integrated, I will definitely be able to change the future. Isn't the simulated result changed in advance just to make me take precautions? Lin and calmed down and repeated the simulation after the cooling down, even though he would die from a nuclear bomb on the 90th day each time, it didn't matter, he just recorded the different information in each simulation and recorded it on his mobile phone, and finally keep it in mind after finishing. In the afternoon, Linen went to the bathroom to untie the gangsters, let them fill their stomachs with instant noodles, and then lock them back in after queuing up in the bathroom for personal hygiene. He also used Tianyantong to check the attributes of this group of people. The information obtained was not unexpected. The willpower is normal and low. Close black lens bracket. Variation possibility, high. Close black lens bracket. Evolution possibility, low, very low, common. Close black lens bracket. After observing some humans on the street and comparing with Zhang Qingshui's data, Linen probably already understood what the intelligence he saw through his celestial eyes meant. People with higher willpower are less likely to mutate. People with lower evolutionary possibilities tend to be more likely to mutate. Linen speculates that mutation refers to zombie transformation. If a person has a high probability of evolution and mutation, then he has a high probability of becoming a mutant or a mutant zombie. Linen also made a bold assumption, if a person's mutation probability reaches high before the apocalypse begins, then he will basically become a zombie the moment the apocalypse arrives. Perhaps, the success rate of a person's evolution is also related to the will. The stronger the willpower, the easier it is to survive the hours of evolution and not fail to become a mutant. Lin and closed the bathroom door. These days, he intends to make the most of it. Once you have acquired any talent, or have any conjectures, use Chen Wei and these good brothers to test it. If you can use some methods to reduce their mutation probability, or improve their evolution probability, maybe it can provide a lot of help to their future. With the eyes of heaven, you can also observe their status in real time and know whether your actions are effective or not. Exercise, simulate, record, analyze. The schedule is adequately arranged, and the speed of time seems to be getting faster and faster. Waiting for another day to wake up, after eating and drinking. Linen, finally ushered in his sixth emulator reset. At this moment, the end is near. Only four days left. Day one, you watched the doomsday quietly and everything that happened around you, you had expected, whether it was Zhang Qingshui's sudden coma, or Yin Xiaoxiao crying while holding her mother who vomited blood. Close black lens bracket. The next day, when you appeared in the Jun team, you temporarily placed Yin Xiaoxiao and others in the Jun team. By showing the strength of yourself and Zhang Qingshui, you gained trust and cleaned up the monsters in the city alone. Close black lens bracket. The third day, you solved the mutated zombies in the morgue, and luckily obtained the talent of spiritual growth again. At midnight, you cooperated with Zhang Qingshui to clean up the rats. Close black lens bracket. Day 4, you and Zhang Qingshui clear the way to J City. Close black lens bracket. Day 5, you communicated actively in the gathering place, and even fabricated yourself to have the ability of prophecy to give yourself a more important right to speak. Your ability was reported upwards and attracted attention. Close black lens bracket. Sixth day, you guarded Lu Yao, and when she successfully evolved, you also proved her ability to prophecy. Close black lens bracket. Seventh day, you proposed to join forces with the gathering place in City J. The proposal is approved, and you personally lead the team to clear the passage. Close black lens bracket. Day 8. As you kill a mutant who can control steel, you gain the ability to control metal. Close black lens bracket. Day 9. You successfully cleaned up City J, allowing the two gathering places to be merged, greatly increasing their strength. 
Close black lens bracket. Day 10. You said your prophecy, zombies and mutants will give birth to a commander, making the zombies converge into a terrifying corpse tide, this sentence caused many people to panic. Close black lens bracket. Linen quietly watched the simulated screen. In this simulation, his random talent was poor, with little improvement. But before this simulation began, he set himself a bold goal. Try to save all mankind and prevent the outbreak of nuclear war. To this end, he did not hesitate to pretend to be a magician with the ability to predict in the simulation to gain official attention. He wanted to see if he could get people's attention and avoid the tragedy of world destruction on the 90th day if he was active. At the very least, I want to get some support and see if I can find a better refuge option than Lonely Island. Lin and watched the simulation screen intently. Time passed by, and gradually, his brows gradually wrinkled. 32nd day. Your many predictions have gradually been verified. The organized actions of zombies and mutants have deeply feared many people, but fortunately, your running is not meaningless, and human beings are prepared. Close black lens bracket. Dot 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 dot. 41st day. Under your appeal, human beings united early, facing the assembled corpse tide. You resisted with difficulty, although there are some bad news, but in this land, human beings will eventually resist live the pressure. Close black lens bracket. Day 42, you made a new prediction that the world will be destroyed by nuclear bombs. As soon as this statement came out, it caused an uproar and was valued by the leaders who held the nuclear button. Close black lens bracket. 43rd day, you participated in a meeting, and leaders from other continents also participated in the meeting using satellite networks, and jointly swore that they would never use nuclear weapons or nuclear bombs. Close black lens bracket. 44th day, you feel more at ease, but you still don't dare to relax your vigilance. You are actively trying to find a nuclear shelter, but with little success. With the current situation, it is difficult for human beings to launch a huge war at will, engineering. Close black lens bracket. Dot 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 dot. 62nd day, you finally found a suitable place of refuge, and led many evolutionaries to move the research institute. This underground refuge has terrifying material reserves and is regarded as a nuclear war. After the outbreak, the last place of hope for mankind. Close black lens bracket. 63rd day, you personally led the evacuation plan called Tinder, gathered all kinds of social elites here, countless research equipment was sent here, and you felt that the spark of hope was burning. Close black lens bracket. 75th day, the preparations have been completed and you will conduct the final test in the underground shelter. The scale of only 1,500 people carries the last hope of mankind. Close black lens bracket. 76th day, the preparations on the ground are also on track. Many people are willing to believe your language. Human beings will move the gathering places away from the big cities and move into the deep mountains and forests where people are rare, hoping to avoid it, open a possible nuclear explosion. Close black lens bracket. Dot 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 dot. Day 87. You closed the sanctuary, and all the survivors prayed that your prophecy would fail. Close black lens bracket. Day 88. You have learned that many leaders are actively destroying existing stockpiles of nuclear weapons. Close black lens bracket. Day 89. You waited silently for tomorrow, although some people still do not want to believe your so called prophecy, but no accident happened due to your efforts. Close black lens bracket. The 90th day, the earth is shaking, you feel the shock wave of terror, and there is still one nuclear war, which shocks you greatly, and the refuge is in panic. Everyone knows that everything you predicted is still happened. Close black lens bracket. Day 91, your electronic equipment suddenly failed, and all the sophisticated equipment suddenly failed to operate. Only a simple tool such as a diesel engine could be started. You suspect that the nuclear explosion triggered the electromagnetic pulse, which caused the electronic equipment to appear. Problem. Close black lens bracket. Day 92, you are in the sanctuary to observe a moment of silence for the deceased compatriots. Close black lens bracket. Day 93, you tried to leave the sanctuary to observe the external environment, but the gate of the sanctuary could not be opened. At the same time, an epidemic broke out in the sanctuary, and some humans suddenly fainted. Substuns are different from evolvers. 
close black lens bracket. The 94th day, the epidemic spread rapidly, and almost 80% of the human beings fell into a coma, except for the evolutionary ones. Close black lens bracket. 95th day, humans who were in a coma gradually woke up, but in the process of waking up, their bodies continued to undergo terrifying mutations. You detected sudden nuclear radiation on their bodies, but even more terrifying is that, there is absolutely no possibility of radiation appearing in your sanctuary. Close black lens bracket. The 96th day, you and the evolutionaries joined forces to kill the radiation monsters that appeared after the mutation. What makes you sad is that most of these monsters are researchers who carry hope in this sanctuary. Close black lens bracket. Day 97. There was suicide in your survivor team, but there was a serious conflict of opinions between the evolutionaries. A serious internal strife broke out. The evolutionaries consciously stood in line, and you split into three groups of different sizes. Close black lens bracket. 98th day, you have a civil war, even if you are prepared before they start, but your existence is regarded as the biggest threat, which has led to the joining of other evolutionaries. The brutal civil war is over. Your injuries are extremely serious. Yin Xiaoxiao and Zhang Qingxie were also killed in the civil war. There are not one out of ten loyal men, even your dog is not spared, only the deer who is also seriously injured remains Yao is still with you. You can see that the rest of the survivors have ghosts and their loyalty to you is limited to the surface. You are disheartened and decide to leave the shelter. Lu Yao chooses to support your decision. Close black lens bracket. Day 99. You and Lu Yao were wandering in the wilderness and witnessed countless monsters being affected by radiation and becoming more terrifying. Close black lens bracket. 100th day, you saw a group of monsters rushing towards your former refuge with a clear goal. The overwhelming monsters make you sure that the wise monsters they were driven from dominate the world, and you the former sanctuary has also become a thorn in their side for some reason. Close black lens bracket. 101 day. You want to go to Lonely Island to see, but you encounter a group of terrifying radiation monsters on the way. They are powerful, and the most important thing is that they also have terrifying toxins. During the battle, you were accidentally injured. You were poisoned. Close black lens bracket. Day 102, you are dead. Close black lens bracket. Linen originally planned to turn off the simulation screen with an expressionless face. However, the next moment, words suddenly appeared in front of him. But it made his originally heavy heart jump with excitement in an instant. This simulation has ended, you can permanently retain a talent and solidify it into the real world. Close black lens bracket. The simulator enters cooling, the number of days in this simulation is 101 days, and the cooling time is 101 minutes. Close black lens bracket. Because you survived for more than 100 days in the simulation for the first time, you will get a reward. In the next simulation, a golden talent will be randomly selected. Close black lens bracket. Please make persistent efforts, a bright future is just around the corner. Linen almost counted the time until the emulator refreshed. A full one and a half hour cooldown made him live like a year. Golden talent. Linen really didn't expect that his emulator would still have these functions. I have to say that compared to the explosive systems I have seen in other novels, my simulator is really Buddhist. As long as he doesn't ask, he doesn't explain. This this surprise, it made him give birth to a lot of thoughts. Simulator, apart from simulating to 100 days, are there any other rewards? Linen asked suspiciously. Please explore by yourself. Close black lens bracket. Isn't that calling me luck? Linen sighed, but told himself not to be too greedy, this golden talent was already a pleasant surprise. You know, the cooldown time of today's simulator is a full one and a half hours. Even if he doesn't sleep and stays stuck until tomorrow, it's just a dozen simulation opportunities. The chance to get golden talent is really good. So slim. This made Lin in a little worried. At present, he has solidified five talents, and counting the talents that have not been solidified today, there are only five. And these five talents are enough for him to last for a hundred days. If he gets any talents that are not easy to die in the future, wouldn't it be a simulation cooling down for a day? Linen pondered for a moment, gritted his teeth, and made a decision. The doomsday simulator doesn't mean that it can't be used until doomsday is activated. Now, 
My top priority is to get the right talent first. After all, after the apocalypse begins, there is no longer a chance to consolidate talent. Starting tomorrow, I have to go crazy in the simulator. While spying on intelligence, I try to shorten my simulation time as much as possible, so that I can get as many simulations as possible and get better talent. As for how to survive the danger after the 100th day, I'll wait until the end of the world. I'll figure it out for myself. At that time, I'll use the simulator and take it step by step. After Lin and made a decision, he looked at the simulator whose cooldown time had expired. The simulator has cooled down, is it turned on? Close black lens bracket. Open black lens bracket doomsday simulator has been opened close black lens bracket. Current optional talents. Black light carrier, old driver, daredevil. Black light virus gold, a virus called. Black light, is born in your body, which is extremely adaptable and can immunize, absorb, or actively devour all viruses you are infected with, and transform your body. It has a strong ability to adapt to the environment and is almost indestructible. Close black lens bracket. Linen stared at this talent and couldn't help frowning slightly. Then, I couldn't help asking the simulator. The simulator, my virus, won't affect me, will it? Like turning me into a non-human, or affecting my emotions or something. It wasn't that he was looking for trouble, but the name of the virus looked familiar. He remembered that in a game called, Killing Prototype, the virus that the protagonist was infected with was the black light virus. The virus said that it was an infection, but in fact it completely replaced the protagonist, completely swallowing the protagonist and obtaining the protagonist's memory. The protagonist Alex in the game, strictly speaking, is the black light virus itself, not a human being. Linen didn't want to click on this talent, but as a result, everyone disappeared and became a carrier of a virus. Isn't it ridiculous? After Linen asked, he didn't even think that his simulator actually gave him a response. The black light virus is only an unconscious auxiliary talent. By absorbing the virus to strengthen and mutate the body, it will not affect the host's own race, thinking, and will not have the ability to actively devour and transform. You need to explore and transform yourself. The virus and the host have a symbiotic relationship, and the host is in a dominant position. The evolution of the virus is mainly based on the host's own wishes, not the virus's instinct. Close black lens bracket. Linen was relieved to see this. Suddenly my mind changed. Simulator, can you explain serious talent to me in detail? Sirius is a lifestyle talent. Having this talent will weaken your luck to a certain extent, making it easier for you to face risks, but it will allow you to gain greater benefits in battle, plunder, and aggression. The return is proportional to the risk. Close black lens bracket. Linen pondered the meaning of this talent. Probably, he had an understanding of how he obtained talent through Sirius. Before, he thought it was all about luck. But now it seems that it is completely determined by the strength of the other party. If you are on the weaker side than the other party, it will be easier to obtain the other party's ability. So the reason why you didn't gain the ability to control the rat swarm in the simulation a few times is because the rat swarm is too weak for yourself now. Linen thinks about it carefully, but it seems to be the same. With Tianyantong, the rat king among the mice has almost nowhere to hide and he fully understands the intelligence of the other party. As long as he uses the evolutionary as a bait to attract, lure it out of the ground, it can be easily solved. However, why can the mutant zombies in the morgue stably contribute a gift of spiritual evolution? Lin An's expression became a little more serious, perhaps, it was because the mutant zombie in the morgue was actually much stronger than he thought. Even if he obtained the information in advance and solved the opponent in the same way as a sneak attack, Sirius still thinks that he belongs to the weak and the strong, so he gave him this talent. Forget it, don't think about it. Linen put this thought aside for a moment, and after realizing that the simulator could answer some of his doubts about talent, he became addicted and licked the wool hard. I asked the simulator for all the talents I had at hand. Unfortunately, most of the answers are similar to my own guesses and insights, and I have not received any additional explanations. Black Light Virus. Linen couldn't help laughing at this talent. He finally, finally doesn't have to be afraid of being poisoned. Don't worry anymore, just after being broken by zombies, you are about to face the dilemma of death. 
Randomly choose two garbage talents to start after starting the simulation. It is a pity for Lin and that the simulation time this time is still not too long. 97th day. You used your tyrannical strength to crush the rest of the evolutionaries who tried to rebel and maintain the peace of the sanctuary. Close black lens bracket. Day 105. You sensed a danger and took the initiative to scout outside the shelter, but found a group of terrifying aberration monsters rushing towards your shelter. You fought bloody battles to protect your friends, the last place to live. Close black lens bracket. Day 106. You have been fighting for a whole day. While the black light virus continues to devour the virus in the monster's body to provide you with physical strength, but you have to face a cruel fact, your friend, your the sanctuary was devoured by this seemingly endless group of monsters. You angrily tried to find out the mastermind behind all this, and dashed all the way to the distance. Close black lens bracket. Day 107. You found out in despair that the more monsters you kill, the more monsters come from afar. It seems that your strength has caused the monsters to fear. Not only is the number of monsters endless, but there are even many extraordinarily powerful aberrations. Even you have been seriously injured many times. If the virus continued to replace your cells to heal the body, you would have died long ago. Close black lens bracket. Day 108. Regrettably, your ability to swallow and digest the virus has an upper limit after all. In addition, it also takes a lot of physical strength to promote the recovery of the virus. Your physical strength is finally exhausted, and the face seems to be inexhaustible. Fallout monsters, you end up being overwhelmed by monsters. You are dead. Close black lens bracket. Linen can only comfort himself like this. This time, I will last a long time at least. Compared with the previous infection, he died immediately and died immediately. He fought for three days and three nights without stopping for a second, or even longer. To say that it lasts for a long time is definitely not too much. Look at the interface where the emulator ends. Linen was mentally prepared. He knows that this time, it is hard to say whether it is strong or not to solidify the talent of, blacklight virus. But, it must be painful. Solid talent, blacklight virus. Thanks for watching, subscribe and support my channel.